Leo Bernier was known by many nicknames, many of them you've heard already. He's been referred to as King of the North, Emperor of the North, Lion of the North, and Minister of the North. One thing that each of these names has in common is the word North, and that's no accident, because Leo Bernier stood for one thing, the North, and his list of accomplishments spanning 21 years in politics show that making the lives of Northerners better was his all-consuming goal one that stood ahead of partisan desires or interests. While we celebrate his political achievements, of which there are many, we are truly here to honor the man, an individual who never once forgot his roots. He was someone who, when he retired, he could have stayed in Toronto and reaped the financial benefits of his years of sacrifice and hard work, but instead he chose to return home, to return to his roots, to the place he loved and the place that he helped build. They say representing this region is a difficult job, and that's true. But it's not because of the reasons that you might think. Yes, we have a vast geography, sprawling hundreds of thousands of kilometers. It's true that there are dozens of communities. But it's, and it's important to know that Mr. Bernier was the first to visit remote First Nations in the Rhine. It's also true that we have a wide, a wide diversity of needs and interests. But none of those are the reasons why this is a difficult to represent. The simple fact is, the challenge is, and it always will be, that Leo Bernier set the bar so high. 21 years, thousands of accomplishments, roads, hospitals, even the Ministry of Northern Development. I do not think it's proper to remember Mr. Bernier as a great politician because I think he was so much more than that. If there's one way I believe we should remember Mr. Bernier, if there's one fitting tribute, I believe it would be fair to remember him as a great northerner who used politics to achieve great things for his community and his region. So I'd like to close by saying on behalf of the people of the Norway River and on behalf of every single northerner, thank you, Mr. Bernie. Thank you for your leadership, your perseverance, your dedication to your community. Thank you for putting the needs of your neighbors ahead of yourself. And most importantly, thank you for setting the bar so high and giving all of us who follow in your footsteps such a lot of people.